Hello, hello, hello everybody. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Sunforia and we are once again playing Starbound. Oh my goodness, did you see my arm go absolutely nuts? <laughs> I'm not too sure what that was about. Uh, I hope you guys have been doing great. I have been doing fantastic. We are back with some Starbound. We are here. There's a little butterfly down there. He's so cute. If I had a bug net, I would catch you. Sounds a bit sinister that really, doesn't it? But I would. Our farm is nicely chugging along. We've got some things growing. We've got a full belly. So let's switch off out of here and let's go. So we are going to go and try and find this archaic energy source. Because this is our first planet, we're probably going to be here at least for a little while. Um, I usually set up my first base on the first planet just because it makes sense. You know, we're here. You may as well. So I'm going to light it up as we go. Just so that we can see what we're doing. There's another rice seed. Definitely grab that. He's going to fall off, isn't he? Yep. I knew it. He couldn't help himself. Uh, we'll use some platforms there. There is some iron there. I'm not too bothered about collecting anything like that right now. But we will get the trees. Chop those down. I can see some cotton, which is really nice. I just want that. Oh, he's seen us. can see things glowing underneath as well that's it run away <laughs> I don't know if he can get back up here now I hope not some more stuffs seeds are kind of what we're focusing on right now uh, put you there potatoes rice more pearl peas There we go. Okay, so we can put these platforms wherever there's kind of like a block here or a background block. So oh, I really didn't. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> My platform placement is not the best. There we go. We could actually do with that fibre. like an empty dead end cave okay let's grab all this so we're gonna need the fiber anyway I could have just cut through I did wonder about that but that's okay grab the copper while we're here I'm not too worried about the coal we did grab quite a lot of that but at least I know where it is ready for next time grab the iron Oh man. Can't wait to upgrade the mana manipulator so that it goes a bit faster. Pop these little guys because I can see there's some iron in the wall behind. We want that. Come on. Okay. There's more coal. Oh, come on. More coal there, which again is really nice. At least we know where it is ready for when we do want some more. Uh, we'll keep this out. Some potatoes. Some more copper. My goodness. Nice to find lots of copper. Ow. Ow. No. No, sir. Uh, we do need to pop one of these. Yeah, we got him. Nearly died. But we got him. Bunnies! So very quickly... Uh, we'll make ourselves some salve now we have a lot of that plant fiber so the difference between salve and bandages is we need another crafting table to make the bandages we can make the salves anytime and they both restore 50 health but the bandages do it over like 10 seconds and the uh, no the salves do it over 10 seconds the bandages do it over one second they're like instant so i like to have both because you can say pop a bandage so you've got instant health and then straight away pop a salve so that you've kind of got some slower regen as well so it's quite nice to have both of them the bunnies in the flower fields we're definitely going to be getting some of this flower grass because it's amazing more copper i'm not gonna pass up copper 
especially when it's in mud, it's super easy to uh, pick up. Okay, I'm going to grab this actually as well while we're here. I know I said I'm going to leave some of the coal, but this is kind of like right on the surface. I'd feel really bad if we left it. And basically on the in the quest in the corner, as you can see, that is the one that we have tracked. That's why it's showing it. And it's telling us to keep going to the left. Now, if you didn't know, in Starbound, uh, the worlds are circular. So if you keep going one... Oh my goodness, that's a lot of potatoes. If you keep going around to the left, you'll eventually end up back where you started, which is really nice. I do like that. My goodness, would have been better going like... It would have been better digging through that mountain. Uh, we do need to make some more wooden platforms though. That will be fine for now. So we've got a little graveyard and usually, yep, there it is, there is a chest. So these are our first little chest, so let's see what we've got ourselves. We have got a manipulator module and quite a lot of pixels. You've obtained a manipulator module. With enough of these, you can upgrade your mana manipulator from the access panel in the right-hand toolbar. Exactly. And you can make the area of effect of your mana manipulator bigger. You can make it faster. And it's got some other functions. Like I showed you at the top at the moment, we can search and look at stuff. Or we can dig. Um, there are other functions that unlock. Which are pretty cool. Oh, a little frog. <gasps> That's a pretty bird. Hello. Oh, he doesn't even want to attack me. That's even better. We're not going to go down in the well. <laughs> uh, one thing I do like about this game is you can swim, unlike Terraria. So that's always nice. So if I went down there, I would be able to swim back up. I wouldn't be stuck forever. Come on. Go. Okay. Another one of these to kind of hop over. I should just dig through, but takes just as long. There we go. Oh, here we are. So this is the archaic energy source. My scans are picking up an unknown radio signal around the archaic energy source. I will patch it through to you now. If you've picked up this message, you must have found an ancient gateway. Please use it to come and find me. You can power up the gate with core fragments. Okay. I have scanned for nearby core fragments. They appear naturally within the geology of this planet. Readings suggest numerous ores are clustered deep below the ground near the planet's centre. So we need to go and get some core fragments. Oh, what are pretty trees? But, my goodness, why is it making that funny noise when I'm chopping it down? Like a tss 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 tss. Come on. Are you, are you never going to chop down? Like, what is going on? <laughs> maybe that one's too close to the, uh, maybe that one's too close to the gateway so it won't fall down. It might be in the protected zone. Oh, a purple one! We want that. Oh, wow. Okay, so we've got an upgrade module, a hiker's jacket, manipulator module, and some irons. So that's, this is one of the vanity items that I was talking about. There we go. Now we look like we're ready to go. We've got a little scarf on. <laughs> oh, we're taking this. This is beautiful. Look at that purple tree. We're going to have those all around our house. I do have a bit of an idea of what we're going to do for a base. So This is perfect. Oh my goodness, what on earth is this? I have never seen anything like that before. Right, we'll take this tree. It's another floor in I've never seen like a building like this before. It has a little farm and everything. Definitely want all the saplings. Hello? Oh, oh my goodness, it's like her little house, but it's got saplings. What has she got? You're just stealing everything. Pearl pea. I've probably got all of these. Rice, corn, we didn't have corn. Hi! How are you? I'm just gonna chill here. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. I've seen other generated structures, but I've never ever seen this. 
You got some pixels and stuff. I'm going to take them. A bucket. She's got a candle, books, flower. We can sleep in beds and stuff and that will regen our health, which is really nice. This is so cute. Oh my goodness. I didn't know you were here. I would have set up my base in your house if I'd have known. That would have been awesome. So what I seem to have found so far is that on these planets, uh, the starter planets. Oh, look at him. Hello. Hello. What I seem to have found on these starter planets so far is that um, you can dig down to get the core fragments as uh as sale tells you to or what you can do is there's usually a mine shaft somewhere and you can go into that and um what i tend to find is if you kill the big guy that's in there he gives you enough core fragments for what you need anyway and usually in the boxes oh oh i forgot snow has uh snow has a physics to it yeah, usually um, you can find enough of what you need in the chest or the guy gives you it at the end if you kill him. So, you will definitely try and actually find one of those. I'm going to jump down here and kind of like just go across because I don't think there's anything that we need down there. Oh my goodness, look at that. He's like a little snowbird. He's so cute. Put a few torches around the place. Hello, mountain goat that's going to try and headbutt me. Hello, other swirly thing that's again going to try and eat me. It's okay. So we've got a snow place on here. We've got a florin place. That's really cool. Did we kill it? Nope. Now we did. Okay. I'm just easing gently over the edge <laughs> there we go put that on there again this isn't too bad as well because it means that we are going to have a way up so i don't mind doing this at all quite a treacherous mountain though Might be worth digging straight across, uh, putting a platform straight across again, and then going down because I can't see that there's anything really helpful. Oh, just got a bit of lag there. Put down like a million torches, but that's okay. No, there's nothing useful down there, so we may as well just completely cut it off, I guess. <laughs> okay. Tomatoes. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Tomato juice. Nice. What on earth is that? It's like a ghost cat. Oh my goodness, it is a ghost cat. Hello. Hello. never seen anything like it I love that he keeps going invisible like floating away he's like meow meow that's so funny uh, I'm gonna put some platforms there oh we've run out we don't have many should be able to make a lot more of those though. Yep, there we go. There we go. So we can make a bit more platforms down just so we don't break our necks. Oh, carrots. More ghost kitties. No ghost kitty. Oh, not three of you. It's really hard to hit things when they're below you. And with the lag too, it is a bit 
You never know whether... Oh my goodness. Really? Three ghost kitties? I feel like they could be hitting me and I wouldn't know because it keeps lagging itself out. More ghost kitties! Like little tiny squirrels. Oh, hello squirrels. I can't get actually in there. Because I need to do this. My head is far too big. <sighs> right, that's one down. Thank you. Oh, goodness. Please, I just want to find some... <laughs> I'm just trying to find somewhere. You don't need to be so rude. Really, you don't. I'm not trying to hurt you. And there's a scary bird that's going to try and eat my face as well. I do need to uh, figure out what the quick select is. So each of the little tabs on the top with the different items in does actually have a quick select, like letter, key binding thing. Oh no, that was a bad idea. Um, and I need to figure out what they are so that I can switch between them a lot quicker and easier when I'm fighting and stuff and I want some uh, come on again it's probably actually going to be easier for me to I'm going to cut through here I probably should have cut through lower down We are hungry too, so let's grab a uh, baked potato before we get our heads demolished by this monster. And while we're in this hole, actually, this is where I'm going to leave it for today. So I hope you have enjoyed this little adventure. We have found the ancient gateway and we're currently on our way around the world to see if we can find a mine uh, to get some core fragments. It was really cool finding that Florin house. I've never seen that before, so that was exciting. So in the next episode, oh we got a nice new shirt, whoop whoop. In the next episode we're going to continue trying to find this mine and if it's not there we'll just dig down through the earth. But the mine is a bit more fun than just me digging down. So yeah, if you have enjoyed today's episode please like, comment and subscribe to Become a Sparkle. I hope you have a fantastic day and I will see you soon. Bye!